my surprise. He did the mash. He did the monster mash. The monster mash. It was a graveyard smash. He did the mash. It caught on in a flash. He did the mash. He did the monster mash. Hey everybody, I am 22 Tiger Dude, and I am here to review the 2011 prequel, The Thing. And this is going to start off Halloween Extravaganza Month of Reviews. And before I review The Thing, we're going to go ahead and let my guest star, Brian Mendoza, aka The Movie Freak 226, take it away. The floor is yours, man. Hey guys, how are you guys doing? Um, I'm going to say thank you to Tony Tony D for letting me join this review of 2011's The Thing. I got to say that the acting is really good from the cast. Especially Larry Elizabeth Winston. She was pretty good. And Joel Edgerton. He's both of them are one of my favorite actors. They're pretty good in this film. But the one thing that I don't understand is that people think this is a remake. Let me explain to you guys. The difference is Mary Elizabeth Winstead's character is different because Kurt Russell's character is McReady. I believe that's his name. I forgot. But this movie is different. The thing takes place, the 2011 prequel takes place before the, this one. If you guys have seen the film. I gotta say, the special effects are pretty good. Really cool, it looks really real. I gotta say, the beginning, it was very scary. It was so awesome, I absolutely loved it. Um, it was pretty good. Uh, I just only watched the original. All I remember was watching the trailer for this one, I didn't know what it was a couple years ago, but overall, I'm gonna give this one a B. I absolutely enjoyed it. It was pretty good. It's not. It's one of my favorite horror films now. One of my favorite prequel slash remakes. Yeah. So back to you, 22 I Hope you guys enjoyed. It. Now back to you. <laughs> Thank you, Brian, for reviewing The Thing on my channel. It was a real pleasure having you guest star on my channel, man. And you guys, Brian Mendoza, he has a very great channel. He has Blu-ray updates. He has movie reviews. The guy is a movie fanatic just like me. Please check out his channel, you guys. He is such a nice dude. I will leave a link to his channel below this video. I haven't seen the original and I'm not sure if I'm going to review the original for Halloween Extravaganza Month of Reviews. I'm not sure if I could promise that. But I do know that I have seen the prequel. My thoughts on the prequel. I liked it. It was refreshing. It was a lot of fun. I wasn't looking forward to the thing. One, because I barely knew anything about it. Two... I had no interest in it, and I just never planned to really watch it. I was actually going to almost see this film in the theaters because I actually had time to see a film and I was just picking randomly, but I had a choice. It was either The Thing or 50-50, but I chose 50-50 over The Thing, so I didn't really see this film until later on. My cousin Jackie and her boyfriend Anthony that came over to the house, her boyfriend Anthony had the thing in his laptop. They asked if we wanted to watch it. I said, okay, I'll give it a chance. I saw it and I just liked the film. I thought the cast did pretty good. There's some average acting, but there's also some pretty good acting here. Joel Edgerton, who I'm actually surprised was in this film. I thought he did a good job here. I thought the storyline to the thing was actually pretty decent. I enjoyed the horror elements that the film added in here. It felt refreshing. It felt pretty original, actually. And I just enjoyed how everything was handling together. Yes, it's cliched. Yes, it's predictable. And that's really all I could say as my gripe for the prequel, that it's cliched in some moments as well as being predictable. And the ending, I thought kind of felt abrupt, but once it led up to what I heard was the event to the original, because I heard during the end credits there was this clip that actually led up to the beginning of the original film, and if this prequel really led up to that, then I have to give it props. And I could kind of forgive the ending being a little bit abrupt for that.
but really the thing was really a huge surprise for me the acting wasn't that bad some average some pretty good the storyline was pretty cool i thought there were enjoyable horror elements the visual effects actually looked pretty good as well and I just had a lot of fun with the thing. I, this was a nice surprise for me. I am going to give the 2011 prequel, The Thing, 3 out of 4 stars. And be sure to stick around for more Halloween reviews on Halloween Extravaganza Month of Reviews.